Dan Watts here from Surf Tech. I'm going to show you how to repair your soft top custom performance board. All we need is some 100 grit sandpaper, some 180 grit to do the fine sanding, a roll of painter's tape, some 60 second epoxy to fill the holes, and also a white flat uh, acrylic spray paint. All the soft top custom performance board have the same bottom on it so it doesn't matter if it's a short board or the long board if you're gonna get uh, some cosmetic cracking and stuff like that in the tail area it's an easy fix so we're gonna start off by sanding this area and prepping it uh, yeah we'll see if we need any epoxy to fill in any of the holes but there is usually just co cosmetic damage in here so we can just fill it in and paint over it. So we'll start with the 100 grit. It's a coarser sandpaper. Gets in there a lot easier. You can already see it's nice and flat already. Maybe just need a little filler in there. There's no soft spots or anything so there was no water intake or anything into the core, so we just need to get this thing flat. Make sure that we have enough area around it that's been hit with the sandpaper, so everything will stick to it. And then touch it up with the fine 180 grit. So now we have our 60 second epoxy and it should set up in about 60 seconds. Then you let it dry for a while and then you can sand it. This goes into here. It pushes out equal parts in your little tray here. Try not to get it everywhere like I did. Then mix the two together with a piece of the packaging cardboard. Make sure the blue mixes well with the clear <laughs> you're gonna use your same piece of cardboard dab it in your area of repair Try to smooth it out as much as possible. It'll save a lot of uh, sanding afterwards. You can also put a piece of uh, cellophane over the top of it to get it nice and flat. But uh, I'll just do a little more sanding in this area. It, you can see it filled in all the gaps and everything. We'll sand around the edges and just get that flat and then tape it off and spray it. We're just trying to sand off the high spots here and rough it up so we can spray it. So we're gonna go ahead and tape this off so we can spray it with the flat white. We're just gonna make a nice little perimeter around it. Make sure that we don't get any paint, or at least not much paint on the EVA.
sure you're getting some white coming out. It's kind of mist over the top of it. Let that dry. So now it's all dried up. Just gonna remove the tape. Got a couple of little lines there. Just take your fine grit sanding block. Just give it a little scuff to it. Put the EVA on the edge. Ready to serve.